video is going to demonstrate how to connect WISE 2410 with WISE 6610, the RF setting SOP. Let's get started it. This is the topology of this video. The main task is to connect WISE 2410 with the gateway WISE 6610 through LoLaWAN protocol. A user can connect your computer or a laptop with WISE 2410 through USB cable and configure this WISE module through WISE Studio software. And then is to connect a laptop with WISE 6610 through Ethernet cable and configure by browser such as Google Chrome. Connect your laptop with an USB and connect with WISE 2410. Open WISE Studio on your laptop. Click on the connect according to the virtual com port number. Go to configuration, RF module. And then connect your laptop with WISE 6610, the LoDAT1 gateway, through Ethernet cable. The default IP number of the gateway is 192.168.1.1. So set up the IP address of your laptop under the same subnet and then click on Submit. Type in the default IP address on the browser. The login's username and passwords are root, R-O-O-T. Go to user modules. Click on LoLaWAN gateway. Set up the same radio frequency on both modules. And then go to Network Server. Create the device of your end node. If you are using ABP mode, then create the device on the activated function. If you are setting OTAA mode for your end node, then create the device in commission function. ABP agreements is the end node. Model, model type. In this demo, of course, this is Y stage 2410. Copy past the network section key and application section key to the gateway and then click on submit. Next step is to create the gateway. In one LoLaWAN network, there could be more than one gateway. In this demo, we only use one gateway, so forward the application to the same gateway network server. Copy the MAC address of itself and then create. To IO status, configuration. Channel 0 means X exit. Channel 1 is Y axis, channel 2 is Z axis, channel 3 is temperature. This example is for channel 0. Enable alarm. High alarm value set up 0 0.25. Click on submit. Now the value is 0 0.19. Now I check twice module. Until the next time, it check the velocity of the module. Now it's over 0 0.4, so high alarm status is on. Go to the scheduling of WANS 2410. You can set up the scheduling, basic or advanced. Basic is to, is to let the WISE 2410 work 24 hours every day. If you are using advanced, then you can set up Monday or Tuesday from 8 o'clock until the next day 8, 8 a.m. This status 
is showing the passing result. If the passing result can doesn't show any velocity or accelerometer or any device information, means the APB agreement parameter does not setting well. You have to check the setting. Go back to router. Click on no rate function. Default setting is disabled. You have re enabled it and the default port number is 1880. Type in the IP address and the port number on the browser. And then on the right side you can import the the sample code. This sample code you can download it from our Advantech Aiden Forum website. After copy pass the sample code, you have to modify the device MAC addresses into your into your MAC addresses. After deploy it, open the dashboard. As you can see on the very top is the information of the devices. The update interval is every 10 seconds, so the timestamp will change after 10 seconds. Then, in the middle is accelerometer, velocity rooming squares. And then is the temperature. And of course, you can set up the time chart according to the timestamp. Thanks for your listening. Have a nice day.